Now to another big story impacting all of us here in the Valley. Right now, our air quality is top of mind for county officials that as smoke and haze continue to blanket our city. We are your first alert weather station and tonight we have team coverage as a smoke advis advisory has been extended. Meteorologist Gina Cancellari is standing by with how long that will last and when we can expect a cool down. But first, Austin Carter with a look at how air quality is being tracked across the nation. And that smoke advisory was actually expected to expire today, but it's now been extended through Monday and officials say there's only one culprit for it. Wildfires continue to burn in California, tearing through hundreds of thousands of miles and destroying homes. Air quality on the list of wildfire impacts, and it has a far reach. As long as they're still burning, we're going to be exposed just because of our location on the map. Dr. Constantine George weighing in on our bad air. Here in Southern Nevada, the Clark County Department of Environment and Sustainability has extended a smoke advisory through Monday, September 21st, due to regional wildfire smoke. And a lot of it also is the weather patterns. You have the airflow coming in and coming out. So there's multiple variables with this. A look at the Environmental Protection Agency's interactive air now map showing conditions as they develop. The red marking unhealthy air to the west in California, the categories are based on the U.S. Air Quality Index. Earlier Saturday, Clark County was also in the red, but at last check, conditions are now moderate. Regardless of your underlying medical condition, whether you're healthy or not, we're all affected. And we have more information about how the county is monitoring those smoke conditions and tips for you at home up on our website, ktmb.com. I'm Austin Carter, 13 Action News.